Archaeologist Randy White is far beneath the hills of France, searching for a special moment in evolution, an era cloaked in mystery, when with hardly a change in appearance, humans began behaving in ways they had never behaved before. He wants to find out how it was that our ancestors became truly human. It's downright scary to be in these cave environments. They are cold, dark, damp, frightening, dangerous places. And you see people going a kilometer underground or two kilometers underground, and you find traces of paintings and that sort of thing. There's something uh, much uh, more profound going on than just an interest in exploration. Perhaps this cave that we're exploring here opens onto our site, which could make, if there were any paintings in this cave, could make them the oldest cave paintings on the planet. It's possible Randy White could one day make a discovery as startling as that made in 1994, when others found underground caverns adorned with over 300 images, some painted 34,000 years ago. The oldest rock art known. But finding art is not the only goal. White wants to find something bigger how the human mind was born. Where once people had looked at bare walls and had seen only walls, now others suddenly saw astounding possibilities. And with art came human technology, human communication, human culture. The question is, what happened to make all this possible? How could it be that a species opened its mind and burst into a new realm. How was it that human ancestors evolved a whole new way of seeing themselves? And in time, transformed the planet. 